Hello, my name is James Schaefer. I am an undergraduate at the University of Massachusetts Amherst, and today I'm going to talk to you about Diorama. Diorama is a system that seeks to increase the efficiency of disaster scene management. First, I will give you a brief background and motivation of the system. Then, I will describe what Diorama does, the main technologies used and its application, and then a demonstration of the current prototype. First, let's go into the background and motivation of the system. There is a disaster in which there are many victims. A paramedic steps onto the scene and immediately begins triaging victims. A triage is a system that assigns a color status to the victim. There are four colors, green, yellow, red, and black. Green, yellow, and red range from minor to critical injuries, and black represents fatally wounded or deceased victims. The triage process is key when it comes to evacuating the victims. Those that need the most critical of attention are evacuated first, or those with minor needs are put lower on the evacuation list. Currently, there is no system in place that keeps track of how many victims there are, where the victims are located, and if all the critical victims have been evacuated. The evacuator has responsibility to ensure that all critical victims are taken care of. But if there's nothing keeping track of the victims, human error comes into play. Mistakes can be made, and someone in need of attention could be forgotten. Diorama ensures this will never happen. Diorama is an enhancement of this triage and evacuation process. Using active RFID technology, the location of the paramedic and victims are obtained. Additionally, each victim has a unique ID that contains the victim's triage color. This information is stored and organized on a server and then displayed on an interface. On the screen, you can see an image of what this interface looks like. As you can see, this interface would greatly aid in managing a disaster scene. As I have said before, currently there is no system used that keeps track of victims, let alone displaying their relative location. On this interface, there is also a live counter of the victims at the disaster scene that updates as victims are triaged and evacuated. The ability to keep track of each type of victim and know their location adds a whole new dimension to disaster relief. So now that we know the motivation and benefit that Diorama can bring to aiding a disaster scene, let us look at the main technology used in the heart of the Diorama system. Active RFID technology is used in finding the location of the paramedic and victims. Active RFID readers are placed strategically to form a zone. On the screen, you can see four readers forming a square perimeter. These readers are constantly listening for surrounding RFID tags. When there is an active RFID tag within range, the readers will receive the tag's beacon. You can see that all the surrounding readers receive the same beacon from the RFID tag. This beacon contains the tag's unique ID. Each reader measures the beacon's signal strength. This signal strength is then converted into a distance. The tag's distance from all the surrounding readers are then inputted into a localization algorithm. The result is a fairly accurate Cartesian coordinate location of the tag. This approach is used for both paramedic and victims. Now that we establish familiarity with the system, let us look at a demonstration of the current prototype. Note the paramedic will be walking around performing triage process to each victim. Victims are represented by a color cone. The color of the cone corresponds to that particular triage color. A portion of the interface will be shown along with the live video. As the paramedic performs the triage, the victim will appear on the interface.